up and starting with yourself, man. Yeah. You know? The scripture tell you, man, that's evil to himself, to whom he shall be good. Yeah. So so if you if you feel feel like you can't be around niggas, then how you gonna unify it? You know? You're gonna have to be around them to unify them. You can't yeah. just do it over the internet, nigga. Which I understand. Because you can't be around niggas, man. You can't be around two thirds. They ain't gonna God. unify in these niggas, God. man. That's what it is, I you, can't you know, you, he know the truth. You can't be around these niggas. They gonna move what you got. They gonna steal it. They gonna rob you. Uh, uh, bring you bodily harm. So you can't be around these niggas, man. Sleep with your wife. You know, we're, yeah, sleep with your wife. We're not out here preaching that you gotta be around all these niggas. We say, we say, fuck the two thirds, man. Cause we know they ain't shit, man. You know, if I was polite, I'd do the same thing. You know, I'll move away from these niggas. You know, but I'm not gonna be out here acting like we supposed to take all niggas in, man. That's the difference between us and him. We're about the elect. We can leave, we can leave our families, we can live amongst the elect. We wish we could, man. We wish we could have our own city, just us, and then we just hop on planes or get on, get on, or get in our cars and go to camp in different cities and states. You know, huh? Say got a boy, boy. Go boy, boy, you know? Yeah. Hey, but the thing is, we admit the truth, bro. We know what it is and we tell it like it is. He's, uh, he's acting. You know what I'm saying? Because we're confident that two-thirds ain't shit for the most part. Sometimes you, you fall short, man. And, and it's mainly with your family members or, you know, or some good pussy or something. You know? You go to, you go to thinking wrong. You know? But for the most part, we know. You know, and then when we mess up, we're like, man, I knew better. Tripping. You know? But we'll tell you two-thirds going to get put to death by the most High. And the two-thirds is uh, the wicked Israelites or Negro, Latino, Native Americans of our people. Okay? The elect is the righteous, the ones that's fighting, the ones that's keeping the commandments to their best abilities, the ones that's waiting on the second coming of your hour shy and truth and sincerity. We ain't talking about you, you slobbing down some fucking, uh, uh, some ham hocks, man. Talking about, won't God do it? No, we ain't talking about you, man. We ain't talking about you that, 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 because you got a degree, you think you get me, you think you somebody, you all into the American system. You trying to go and build a, uh, uh, an institution to stop crime. You're not going to stop crime here, because the so-called white man creates the crime, man. He creates the whole mentality of crime, man. All right? The way he puts the news and he put like to put Jake on TV all day when they commit crimes. And then when Esau do it, it ain't, it ain't on TV. You know? It got, it got the whole world thinking like in, in Omaha. You got think got the whole world thinking North Omaha is it, it, fucking Afghanistan, man. They do that in all cities, man. In all cities when the so-called white man is the biggest thief on planet Earth. He's the biggest, he's the biggest murderer on planet Earth. You know, he the type of he the type of motherfucker to go and, and, and do a nuclear warfare in Syria and then turn around and bomb him. You know, it's like a double whammy of killing the uh, West Indian trade <coughs> dealing with fucking uh, the poppy fields and, and all these, all these drugs, man. Operation Fast and Furious. You know, we don't have no Operation Fast and Furious when we giving. Uh, Mexico guns, and, and we're getting tons of, of, of drugs, man. You know, Jake probably get caught with pounds and, you know, things like that, but we ain't, we ain't coming in this motherfucker with submarines or got a whole army or got a whole CIA system of wickedness, man. But you don't hear about that. And even if you hear about that, the, the majority still question whether it's legit or not, man. We tell you about Rex 84 and, and all these other uh, 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 conspiracies of the so-called white man, which is horrendous hate crimes, man. The fucking Willie Lynch Project, man. We don't have a whole institute mindset of, of Darwinism and all that, man. We don't have that. But let a nigga get caught shooting somebody, which is wrong in itself. The whole world think all niggas bad. But let one of you crackers do something, or, all, or one police officer do something, or all of us ain't like that. Then you can put that mindset together. You know? 
Because when the rich man speaker, people will just listen, man. You had something? This is Proverbs 28, verse 5. Evil men understand not judgment, but they that seek the Lord. Yeah, when you see a fucking a, 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 a lesbian, a butch, a faggot getting stoned. Oh, why would they do such a thing? Like, like, hey. I was joking earlier, I was looking at a post at a little chick in a wheelchair instigating a fight of a, 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 a normal woman, a normal lady. She rolled up on her, talking like, what's up, what's up? And pulled on her and yanking her and like, yo, what's up, man? And the girl saw the girl that, that was that was normal in a normal home in the States and started hitting the bang, 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 bang. And everybody like, oh, that's wrong. How could you do? What the fuck you talking about? You don't do that, man. Don't don't poke a sleeping sleeping lion, man. Why would you laugh at somebody getting mauled by that lion? Cause he was poking him, poking him with a stick for fucking two hours, man. God. That's what happens, you know. Like I understand exactly why she got beat up like that, you know. Of course the girl should have walked off, but everybody ain't gonna walk off. Hey, bro. You know, it's crazy because I was like, yeah. she literally had the ability to walk away. Yeah, she had the ability to walk away, push her, walk and make her slide back and walk away. <laughs> you know? And it kind of pissed me off at first because it's like, why the fuck are you so proud you're going to try to fight a motherfucker that can walk? I would have just went behind you and rolled your ass to like, yeah. take you out your ass, you know? It's just crazy, man. And you approach him, you approach him like you can walk. Like, what's up? Come on, run up. You know? Order, but we understand judgment. When a homosexual gets stoned, when a nigga, when a nigga go to jail, when the eater might get done with, we understand judgment on all aspects, not just the so-called white man's judgment. Judgment all around, because everybody is wrong at a point, man. You know? Go ahead. Evil men understand not judgment, but they that seek the Lord understand all things. Yep. Better is the poor that walketh in his uprightness, that he that is perverse in his ways, though he be rich. Yeah, because you're, you're more destructive, man. You know? And then crackers will do something. They're so, they're so perverse in their judgment. When we say a homosexual should be put to death, and they say we're the reason for all this hate in the world. No, we are not, man. Okay? A, a person that's in the KKK, they're the reason for racism towards black people. That's what it is. Their judgment is so perverse that they don't even know how to do it anymore, man. Just want to tell it how it is, man. Not fabricate and reach. All right? We didn't, we didn't, we didn't put syphilis in, 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 in Negroes and just to see how it worked and don't give them the, the proper medication to stop it. We didn't do that, man. We didn't sit there and ride on horses on horseback in, in, in uh, Molotov Negroes' houses, man. So when ne Negroes react and beat the hell out of Cracker or do whatever they do toward them, and we out here preaching and telling and, and telling that, are y'all the reason why all this hate is going on? No. We're just telling you what's happening, man. It's cause and effect. You, you fucking teach that shit, man. It's cause and effect, man. Uh, Ecclesiasticus chapter 6 and verse uh, verse 5. It says, Sweet language will multiply friends, and a fair speaking tongue will increase kind greetings. So pretty much why I brought that out is that's that's what Esau does. Esau and the these uh these um, um pro pro love pro love everybody Negroes, man. Oh, oh, that, oh, that, that smile they do. Yeah. You know? <laughs> How you doing? You know? Fucking supervisor, she do that shit. She got that super face now. She like bitch, I know, and she hold that bitch until, and I'm just looking like. Then the other supervisor, he goes, "What's up? And what's going down? Like, what the fuck is that about? You know, like, come on, man. You ain't gotta do that. I understand you're a supervisor, hey, man. We know, we not, we not speaking the the sweet sweet words that they want to hear. You know, we speaking the truth. That's why we got. That's why we got so many enemies. But why do you have us now? Shy for it because that that separates. The bullshit from the real. Man. Hey, let's get that. You know? uh, uh, go into them when men speak well of you. Well of you, you know? It's, we're, not in the, we're not out here to make friends. 
we're out here to gather the elect, to bid the, the bid the elect to the marriage, man. That's it. You got one job, man. I'm not out here to be your friend, man. I got I work in the medical field. You got somebody that's, you know, they're not supposed to walk, right? They're 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 uh, non weight bearing on whatever the leg. And then the person's like, I wanna walk, I wanna walk. And you, I wanna be nice and let you walk. I'm gonna fuck your leg up, man. I'm not here to be your friend. I'm, not, I'm here to make sure your leg heals. And sometimes it takes me telling you, sit your ass down, man. And at this time, what I'm saying in this truth, we gotta tell Jake to sit your ass down, man. All day, every day, man. You going off, you wicked, the Lord gonna kill you, man. You found it? <clears throat> Luke 6 and 26. Woe unto you when all men shall speak well of you, for so did their fathers to the false prophets. Yeah. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So what, what congregation gets what congregation get the most heat? What congregation get the most love? You know? The Lord, the Lord, the Lord's judgment is not. The Lord's word is not slack. His judgment is not slack. You know? It ain't like he wrote that scripture and it kind of pertains to No, man. These, these prophets, is, the churches get the most love. And, if, and once you get into Israel, hey, they can't get the most love. They can do everything in the world. They, 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 they only work, they only doing the work during the winter. They, uh, they make fun of and mock the name of the Most High. But yet they get the most love, man. You know? Go oh, ahead. Yeah. Oh, they, they got to show they have a little bit more to it. Oh, probably a little, a little bit before that. Huh, okay. Uh, Matthew 6 and 24. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to... Uh, Oh. It's, a, it's a good it's a good fit. Okay, I'm going to start at 20. Uh, <clears throat> Luke 6 and 20. And he lifted up his eyes on his disciples and said, Blessed be ye poor, for yours is the kingdom of the Most High. Blessed are our riches of the kingdom of the Most High. Okay, go ahead. Blessed are ye that hunger now, for ye shall be filled. Blessed are ye that weep now, for ye shall laugh. Blessed are ye when men shall hate you, and when they shall separate you from their company <laughs> and shall reproach you and cast out your name as evil for the son of man's sake. There's a lot of a lot of Negroes that don't want to get the truth. They they are they are fear, their fears are not being accepted by society. You know? You got your you get shaving your beard, you know, getting lined up, because you you be like, I ain't gonna get no hoes. Like, but it's a blessing, man. You know, you gotta be kingdom minded. You got these, these, these bitches out here that shit. Even the big booty bitches, big titty, pretty face, all that. These, these women gonna be running rampant and these women gonna be right in the mud. You know? You gonna have multiple women like that, man. You know? Or you, you, you don't wanna say that you hate an Edomite because you don't wanna lose, lose your friends or you want people to look at you in a certain way, man. You know? That's, that's, you gonna be blessed, man. For, for standing so strictly for the name of the Lord, man. Yeah, because it, it made sure to put that in there. It didn't say, uh, woe unto you, you know what I'm saying, when you when people speak evil of you, because you can do wicked things when people speak evil of you. It said, uh, when they speak evil of you for your Awashai's sake, man. All right? For preaching and doing the works, man. You know? And Awashai said, don't marvel when the world hate you because they hated me first. So... When you're doing things for your house, I say you're automatically going to be hated. Yep. We ain't talking about church. Oh, how you doing, brother? Ain't going to do it. You know? Like all that. No, man. We out here like doing the Lord going to kill you, man. That's what all the disciples, you know? You know, bless, bless us when you serve the Lord. Do this. You know, stop doing that. Being a, being a, being very judgmental. Yeah. You know? Execute judgment of right. That's, that's, that's what men of the Lord do, man. That's what they always do. They get things in order. You know? They don't sit there and lollygag. Let, let's get that in when it says, make thy face hard against their faces, man. It's a battle, man. Prepare for war. We have come here <laughs> expecting a, a good old, a, a, a hearty good time. 
You know, when we come in a game like that, it's time for war, man. You know? When we about to go to camp, it ain't like, you know, yeah, we about to have some fun, yay! It's like, man, come on, let's curse these, curse these niggas out, curse these, these two thirds out, man. That's, you know, we preparing for war, man. Because we don't know what we gonna run into, man. You know? Hope for the best and expect the worst. Ezekiel 2 and 8. It says, uh, Behold, I have made. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll just start with that. Uh, so Ezekiel should, should go up a little bit back. I'm okay, gonna count. Some, some stuff before that, some good stuff. Come, come. Ezekiel, uh, Ezekiel 2 and 4. And he said unto me, Son of man, go, get thee unto the house of Israel. Yeah, not the whole world. The Bible always talks about Israel, some Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. Because we're. If you got skin like this, I mean you have from Africa, man. Because think about it. Everybody started out with skin like this. The only nation on planet Earth that didn't have skin like this was the so-called white man, which is the Edomites, according to this time. And guess what? They're the last nation next to us. Everybody had melanin at a point, man. And everybody wasn't African at a point. 